Good morning, Mr. Sun. What a beautiful day. A perfect day to go out and play. Oh, no. My clock. You've broken your alarm clock. Don't worry, Amy will fix it. Never mind, Morgan. You didn't mean to break it. It was just bad luck. I suppose so. What a great day, B2. The best, B1. What should we do today? Hmm. Hey, bananas! Hello, Morgan! Do you want to play softball with me? Softball? We love softball! It's banana-tastic! You throw, I'll bat. And I'll catch the ball when you hit it. Then I hope you got long arms. Why's that? Because I'm going to hit it high right over the house. Here it comes, Morgan. My super-swerving banana ball. I got it! I've got it! I didn't get it. Oh, no, the window. Morgan! I didn't mean it. Uh, that's fixed it till Charlie can come around and put in a new window. I'm sorry, Amy. Don't worry, Morgan. It was just a bit of bad luck. Bad luck again? Bad luck can happen to anyone. But why does it keep happening to me? It was an accident. That's all. Well, I'm going to make it up to you. Who wants an ice cream from Rat's shop? Yes, please. Thanks again for the ice creams, Rat. Oh, my pleasure, Morgan. Enjoy the cheese and chocolate flavour. Now, I'm off for a ride on my new bike. Here you are, everybody. Ice creams all round. Look out for those plants. A plant. <laughs> Amy. Why don't you look where you're going? Oh, don't be upset with Morgan, Amy. It's just bad luck. Even more bad luck. More bad luck. Nothing's gone right for Morgan this morning. He broke his clock, then the window. Now Amy's got ice cream all <sighs> over her. <laughs> it sounds like Morgan is a real bad luck bear. A bad luck bear? Oh, Rat's right. That's what I must be. A bad luck bear. Morgan, come back. Rat didn't mean that. It was just an accident. Don't worry, Teddies. We'll talk to Morgan. Right, B1? Right, B2. Rat was only joking, Morgan. Besides, there's no such thing as a bad luck bear. Yes, there is. Everything I touch goes wrong. I'm bad luck to be around. Oh, that's not true. We're around you. And there's nothing wrong with our luck. See? Do you hear what I hear, B1? I think I do, B2. It sounds like something buzzing. Buzzing bees! Run, B1! I'm running, B2! <laughs> Into the water! <laughs> See, Bananas? That was all my fault. Your fault? No, it wasn't. It was. I'm a bad luck bear and bad luck follows wherever I go. Poor Morgan. It's not always his fault when things go wrong. But if he thinks he's a bad luck bear, then he'll be a bad luck bear. Then we have to stop him thinking that. But how? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's good luck bear time. I knew 
knew it! The bananas always come up with a plan. What is it, bananas? We'll give Morgan a lucky charm. A four-leaf clover. But what if it doesn't work? We'll make it work. But we need your help. Here's what you have to do. A four-leaf clover's a great idea, B1. Thank you, B2. But all these clovers have three leaves. See? One, two, three. If only we could make a three-leaf clover into a four-leaf one. We can. We can? With our trusty glue stick. We just stick on an extra leaf. And Morgan will never know the difference. We put a little glue here and stick the extra leaf like so. A four-leaf clover. Do you think this is going to work, B2? We'll soon find out, B1, because there's Morgan now. Hi, Morgan. What are you doing? <sighs> I was building a sandcastle, but the waves washed it away. More bad luck. That's just the tide coming in. No, it's me. I'm a bad luck bear. Not anymore. A four-leaf clover? A lucky four-leaf clover. Keep this with you at all times. And you'll be a good luck bear. Uh, thanks, Bananas. But I don't think it'll make any difference. Give it a chance. Who's for some softball down by the lake? Come on, Morgan. You can play too. All right. I just hope I don't break anything. I hope the teddies are ready for the next part of the plan. The good luck bear plan. Ready with the munchy honey cake? Munchy honey cake in position. How do you feel, Morgan? Do you feel lucky with your four-leaf clover? Nothing makes me feel lucky. I'm a bad luck... Hey, what's that? It looks like a munchy honey cake. It is. It is a munchy honey cake. But what's it doing here? It's just waiting for some lucky bear to come along and pick it up. A lucky bear like you, Morgan. The lucky charm clover is working already. Maybe. Next stop, the lake. Here they come now. Batter up, Morgan. Hit it as far as you can. That's not such a good idea, Bananas. With my bad luck, I'll probably lose the ball. Never. You're a good luck bear now. OK, I'll try. Here it comes, my supersonic banana ball throw. Oh, see? I told you I'd lose the ball. Huh? How did that happen? This really is your lucky day, Morgan. It must have bounced back off something. I love this plan. Every time Morgan hits the ball into the bushes, we throw another one back out again. Here it comes again, Morgan. My twister armor banana ball throw. Great hit, Morgan. Oh, the ball has to be lost for sure this time. Oof! That's impossible. Nothing's impossible for a good luck bear. Maybe you're right, Bananas. Maybe that four-leaf clover really is working. Hello, Morgan. Hello, Bananas. How's the softball game? <laughs> You'll never guess what's happened. I've stopped being a bad luck bear. That's great. It's all thanks to the Bananas and their lucky four-leaf clover. Our pleasure, Morgan. My luck's changed. I'm a good luck bear now. Morgan, be careful. I'm okay, but my lucky four-leaf clover. Phew, it's still okay. What? It's not real. The bees! Bees? Ah! Ah! Oh. We're sorry, Morgan. We thought a good luck charm would make you feel good. And make you believe you weren't really a bad luck bear. Thanks for trying to help, everyone. But it looks like I'm stuck with bad luck forever. Help! Help! 
My brakes won't work! Help! Oh, we've got to help Rat. But how? Sorry, your trick won't work. Not this time. It's not a trick! We had nothing to do with it. Rat really can't stop his bike. Help! You're right. Hang on, Rat. I'm coming. Morgan, take the shortcut. Morgan, what a wonderful stroke of luck that you came along when you did. Do you mean that? I most certainly do. Did you hear that? You really are a, a good luck, luck bear. bear. Feel like a game of softball? I learned one thing. When things go wrong, it's not because you're a bad luck bear. Sometimes accidents just happen. Oops! I think we've just caused an accident now. A very big accident. What should we do? Run! <laughs> when did Morgan say they'd be ready, B2? Right about now, B1. It's Muffin Time! Morgan's making muffins for everyone. Because everyone loves them! The muffins! We know about the muffins, Morgan. That's why we're here! The muffins are missing! Missing? I put the muffins out on the table to cool. Then I went to my room and when I came back, the muffins were gone! Gone?! I know one thing about muffins, they don't have legs! Do you think someone took them? Someone in Cuddles Town? Look! Ooh! Someone left their footprints. Whose could they be? They might lead to the missing muffins. Follow the footprints! Let's go, B2! Going, B1! Follow me! Follow, Follow him! <laughs> this way! Right, right behind, behind you, Morgan! These tracks head for the farm. The farm? With our farm friends. And look at his feet! Oh, oh no! no. Huh? Oh, what? Do you know anything, Pedro? Tell us if you do! Know <laughs> what? What are you talking about? The muffins! Muffins? What muffins? So what happened exactly, Pedro? You said to come over to have a muffin, Morgan. So... I came over. Then you did come into the kitchen. That's how you left the footprints. But I didn't see any muffins. You mean they were already missing? That's right. You have to believe me. We believe you, Pedro. Because you're our friend. Aren't you forgetting something, Bananas? What? The pie. Remember the time you baked a pie and Pedro snitched it? That's right, he ate the lot! Hmm, we did forget that. Okay, I admit, I did once take your pie, but I didn't take any muffins, I promise! Okay, Pedro, we believe you. If you didn't see the muffins... You didn't see them, but we still have no muffins. How did they go missing? Do you think the teddies really believe me? Of course they believe you, Pedro. Just like we believe you. Oh, if only someone could find those missing muffins.
Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B2? I think I am, B1. It's Detective Bananas time! We have to solve this mystery, B2. And to solve a mystery... You need clues. Clues. What sort of clues? Hmm... Crumbs! Crumbs. Crumbs. No crumbs here, B1. And no crumbs here, B2. There must be some crumbs somewhere, B2. Then let's find them. Look for signs. Look for clues. Stay alert for any news. Be on guard. Ears to the ground. And listen hard for any sound. Banana detectives, banana detectives, we're on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives, whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history. Banana detectives, banana detectives, no case too hard to crack. Soft of tread, shh, soft of voice. Creep along and make no noise. Sneak about, stay in disguise, and never ever get caught by surprise. Banana detectives, banana detectives, we're on the trail, hot on the track. Banana detectives, banana detectives, whatever the mystery, it'll soon be history. Banana detectives, banana detectives, no case too hard to crack. No case too hard to crack. No crumbs anywhere, B2. Hmm, what should we do, B1? We should ask everyone a question. Right. Uh, what question? Where were they when the muffins went missing? Where was I? When the muffin disappeared. Do you have any clues? Well, uh, I was in Rat's shop when the muffins went missing. I don't have any clues. Uh, what are you doing? Looking for crumbs. Hmm. No crumbs, B1. Then we'd better check out Lulu. When the muffins went missing, I was outside in the garden. You didn't see anything, Lulu? You don't have any clues? I'm sorry, but I didn't see anything and I don't have any clues. Hmm. Hmm. No crumbs. Me? Sorry, Morgan. We have to check everybody. They were my muffins, Bananas. If I knew why they were missing, they wouldn't be missing. That's a good point, Morgan. So you don't have any clues? Any clues at all? I don't have a single clue. Crumbs. Crumbs. Crumbs! Crumbs? Oh, they're crumbs from the toasted cheese sandwich I had for lunch. Mmm, toasty. Cheesy. Definitely not muffin crumbs. Mm. We're sorry, Pedro. We can't find any clues. With no clues, we can't solve the mystery. Oh, you did what you could, Bananas. Thanks for trying. And thanks for believing me. <laughs> Hi, Detective Bananas. How's the detective work going? Not very well, Lulu. 
We haven't found any clues. We don't know how the muffins went missing. Hmm. Well, did you ask Morgan to act out what he did when he made the muffins? Did we do that, B2? Uh, no, I don't think we did, B1. Maybe you can find out something new that way. Great idea, Lulu. We'll ask Morgan to do that right now. Wait for us! Show us what happened, Morgan. Right from the start. Which is the best place to start? I mix the muffins up, put them on a tray and put the tray in the oven. What did you do then? Don't leave anything out. Hmm, the muffins baked and when they were ready, I took them out and put them on the table. And then? I, I, I made some icing for the muffins. I went to the cupboard to get some sugar. See, this sugar right here. I forgot to put it back. Huh? Ah, oh, the muffins! <gasps> the missing muffin mystery is solved. Because the muffins aren't really missing. But I, what did I do? I think we know. You took the sugar out of the cupboard. When you did that, you put the muffins into the cupboard. Then you went to your room and forgot what you did. That's when Pedro came into the kitchen. He looked all over, but there were no muffins. Then he left, just like he said. Just like we believed him. I feel terrible. I didn't really believe Pedro when he said he didn't know anything. You can make it up to Pedro. And you can do it right now. I will. Will you forgive me for not believing you, Pedro? No problem, Morgan. Thanks, Pedro. And thanks to the bananas for solving the mystery. It was nothing, Pedro. Nothing that good detective bananas wouldn't do. Give Pedro his surprise, Morgan. I am. I am. We've got you a present, Pedro. Fresh muffins. And they're all yours. Muffins? Oh, my favourite. Fantastic. Oh, thanks, Teddies. Another mystery solved, B2. By the Detective Bananas, B1. Wow! <laughs> Morgan! Arr, I'm Pirate Lulu! Come on, Pirate Crew, we've got a treasure to bury! Oh, Ooh, treasure. treasure! Let's start digging, Pirate B1! Aye, aye, Pirate B2! Oof! Uh, playing pirates, Bananas! <laughs> That's right, Rat! We're burying this treasure! Arr. Oh, you know, my great-grandfather was a real pirate. A real pirate? I didn't know there were real pirates. His name was Peg Leg Rat. He buried his treasure under Cuddles Avenue. And no one has ever found it. There's real treasure buried under Cuddles Avenue. Absolutely. It's been there for years. Oh, Rat, that's just a story. Well... Uh, maybe it is a story. Or maybe there's buried treasure just waiting for someone to find it. Oh, a real buried treasure, B1? Which no one has ever found, B2. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's treasure hunting time. What a good idea, Bananas. Uh, Rat, there's just one problem. How will we know where to look for this treasure? What an excellent question, Bananas. And it just so happens that I have the answer. I know it's in here somewhere. Ah, here it is. <coughs> <coughs> now, this is what you need to find the treasure, Bananas. It's a metal detector. Oh. Uh, what's a metal detector rat? 
I'll show you. I put this metal coin under the rug, like so. Then I run the metal detector over it and... Ta-da! 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 It can find metal through anything, even under the ground. And since treasure is metal... It'll show us where the treasure is. That's right! We'll buy it, Rat! A very wise decision, Bananas. With this metal detector, we'll find the treasure in no time, B1. And we can dig it up with these shovels Rat sold us, B2. So, so let's start treasure hunting! Treasure already, B1. Let's start digging, B2. Oh! Oops. Sorry, B2. No harm done, B1. Oh! Sorry, B1. <laughs> Not to worry, B2. Look, B2. There's something sparkly down there. It looks like diamonds. We found, found the, the treasure. treasure. This is so exciting, B1. I can't believe we've actually found a, a hairband. Well, that's not treasure, B2. But it's a nice hairband, B1. Very nice, B2. I think we've seen it somewhere before. You're right, B1. We've seen someone wearing it. But who? Topsy! Oh, hello, Bananas. Hello, Topsy. We found something we think belongs to you. Ta-da! Oh, you found my hairband! My favourite hairband! I lost this ages ago in the park. How did you ever find it, Bananas? Well, we were digging for treasure and we found your hairband instead. Well, this is treasure to me. Thank you so much, Bananas. <coughs> mwah, mwah. Oh, uh... We'd better get back to our treasure hunt, B1. Yes, right away, B2. <laughs> Bye, Bananas. Thanks again. I don't know why we didn't try the beach first, B1. Yes, there's sure to be treasure here, B2. Ooh. Let's start digging, B2. Wait a minute, B1. We don't want to cover each other with dirt like last time. Definitely not, B2. So why don't I dig and you stand over there? Good idea, B2. Ahem. Uh, B2, maybe you could throw the sand the other way? Oops, sorry, B1. Look, B2, there's something shiny in the hole. It looks like silver, B1. We found the treasure. This is it, B2. A real buried... Bicycle bell? That's not treasure, B1. No, B2. But I think I know who it belongs to. Morgan! Hello, Morgan. Oh, hello, Bananas. Did you lose this by any chance? My bicycle bell. Where did you find it, Bananas? Well, we were digging for treasure. And we found your bell instead. Thanks, Bananas. I got this for my birthday, so I was really sad when I lost it. I'm going to put it on my bike right now. And we'd better get back to our treasure hunt, B1. Definitely, B2. Bye, Morgan. Bye, Bananas. And thank you. What are you doing, Bananas? We're looking for treasure, Pedro. Pirate treasure. Pirate treasure? Will I never, never, ever? Ooh! It must be the treasure this time, B1. It has to be, B2. Let's dig it up. Oh, oh, oh bananas. Oops. Oops. Sorry, Pedro. Uh, that's all right, bananas. I quite like mud. Look, B2. There's something shiny down there. It looks like gold, B1. We've, We've really, really found, found the, the treasure, treasure this time. time. Oh, how exciting. How very exciting. Oh, no. This isn't treasure either, B2. Oh, how unexciting. How very unexciting. I think... 
think I've seen that watch before, Bananas. So have we, Pedro. Hello, Hello Bernard. Bernard. Look what we found. Oh, my old gold watch. I thought it was lost forever. Oh, I'm so glad you found it, Bananas. My grandfather gave it to me. It's very special. Hello, Morgan. Look, the Bananas found my bicycle belt too. And my favourite hairband. Well, well. Sounds like you've found all kinds of treasures, Bananas. We have. All except the treasure we were looking for. We can't find that anywhere. Can we, B1? No, B2. Still, I suppose we'd better keep looking. Bye, everyone. Bye, Bye Bananas. Oh, poor Bananas. What a pity they can't find the treasure. Especially when they've been so nice returning all our things. If only there was something we could do to cheer them up. Maybe there is. Listen. <laughs> Quick, Topsy, hide. <laughs> Hello? There's no one here, B2. That's odd, B1. Wait a minute. What's this? It looks like a map, B2. There's a big X. And a skull and crossbones. It's, it's a, a pirate, pirate treasure, treasure map. <laughs> Look, the treasure is at the beach, B1. Let's get down there right away, B2. Bananas are right behind us. Who oh, are uh, coming? The map shows the treasure near that palm tree, B1. Let's see if the metal detector can find it, B2. We found it, B1. Dig as fast as you can, B2. <laughs> Look, B1. A, A real, real treasure chest. chest. This must be Peg Leg Rat's treasure, B2. Let's open it, B1. <gasps> gold! Wait a minute, B1. This isn't gold. It's chocolate. Chocolate? That's even better, B2. But, B1, why would Peg Leg Rat bury chocolate? <coughs> I'm afraid. It isn't real pirate treasure, Bananas. Bernard? Morgan? Topsy? What are you doing here? We buried that treasure, Bananas. And we made the map so you could find it. We wanted to say thank you for returning all our treasures, Bananas. So we buried a treasure for you to find. You did? For us? Uh-huh. B1, I think making our friends happy is even better than finding the real treasure. You're right, B2. And I think chocolate treasure is better than gold anyway. Uh, did someone say gold? What? You found the treasure? That's... that's amazing. I didn't even think there was one. This isn't Peg Leg's treasure, Rat. It's a different treasure altogether. But if you found one treasure, that means there could be more. Rat, you don't understand. <laughs> oh, yes, I do. I want to buy that metal detector back so I can start looking. But you'll be wasting your time, Rat. We'll see about that. Peg Leg's treasure is as good as mine. Mine! Mine, I tell you! Oh, oh that, that rat, rat in a hat. hat. Here, have some treasure, everyone. It's the yummiest treasure ever. <laughs> <laughs> It's only a week to go till the sports carnival, B1. And look how hard everyone's practising, B2. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. He got it. Good catch, Pedro. Oh, thanks, Bananas. Ready to practise our three-legged race, B1? Ready, B2. Then off we go. Oh, oh sorry, B2. No problem, B1. Let's try going the other way. 
go! Hi, Bananas. Isn't this great? I can't wait for the sports carnival. What sports are you doing, Morgan? All of them. All of them? That's a lot of sports, Morgan. That doesn't worry me, because I've got my super teddy muscles and my favourite super fast sneakers. See? <laughs> What's wrong? Sorry, Morgan, but oh, your sneakers are a little bit stinky. I've never lost a race when I've worn these sneakers. That's why they're my favourites. Right. Got to go. I've ten more laps to do before I finish training. Bye, Bananas. Hi, Morgan. What beautiful flowers, Amy. And they smell beautiful too. Hi, Amy. Hi, Lulu. Ooh. They don't smell beautiful to me. That's not the flowers. That's something else. It's in this room somewhere. Getting warm. Getting warmer. Phew! Oh, it's Morgan's sneakers. My sneakers don't smell. I'll prove it. Here. Ugh. I'm sorry, Morgan, but that smell is too awful. You can't have those sneakers in the house. They're my favourite super fast sneakers. I need them for the sports day. They have to go out. If my sneakers go out, I'll have to go out too. Bye, Morgan. All right then, if that's how you feel. Hup. Hup. Good work, B2. We're getting the hang of it now, B1. Hi, Morgan. What are you doing sitting here all by yourself? Oh, I don't want to stay with Lulu and Amy anymore. What? <laughs> they don't like my sneakers. And if they don't want my sneakers around, then I won't be around either. Gosh, that's serious. Where will you stay? Nowhere. But you have to stay somewhere. <sighs> I suppose so. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. Morgan, it's stay with the bananas time! You can stay here as long as you like. But we're sure that won't be for too long. You bananas are now my new best friends ever. Huh? huh? Now, what's to eat? I'm starving. Best friends? What about Lulu and Amy? Don't worry, B1. Morgan will make up with them soon. I'm sure you're right, B2. What are we going to do, B2? It's been five whole days, B1. And Morgan's still here. It's banana-strophic. Nothing has been the same since Morgan got here. Did you hear that noise, B1? It's coming from the kitchen, B2. I hope it's not a burglar, B1. Hi, Bananas. It's Morgan. I just had to have some yellow jellies. So many? Don't worry, though. I've replaced them with some other food. See? I brought you this big cabbage from our garden. Not only does he wake us up and eat all our jellies... He also leaves his toys out and forgets to pack them away. Morgan! Then there's his exercises. <laughs> But the worst thing of all... Hi, oh, Bananas. I've just been out for a run. Morgan's sneakers still smell. That's it, B1. We have to get Morgan and the teddies back together again. But first, we have to fix Morgan's sneakers. Ready to start work, B1? Ready, B2. Barbecue tongs, please. Barbecue tongs. Right then, let's go. Prepare for super spraying, B1. Super sprayer ready, B2. Prepare for sneaker scrubbing, B1. Sneaker scrub ready, B2. Time for 
the sneaker drying, B1. Super sneaker dryer ready, B2. Prepare for flower power anti-smeller, B1. Flower power anti-smeller ready, B2. Do you think it will work, B1? There's only one way to tell, B2. Ready to go, Amy? I suppose so. But I wish Morgan was going with us. He'll be there. He never misses a sports carnival. Oh, I know. But I've missed him, even if his sneakers were smelly. I miss him too, Amy. But he'll come back. <laughs> he always does. We're gonna play games, games. We're gonna play games. We're gonna play games today. Games, games. We're gonna play games. And we're gonna play all day. Hello, teddies. Surprise! <gasps> Morgan's sneakers! Run! Stop! It's okay. Are you sure? Go on, smell them. Uh, you first, Lulu. <gasps> You're right! They don't smell like Morgan's sneakers at all. Well, well done, done, bananas. Hi, bananas. Hi. Used to be best friends, teddies. We're sorry you had to leave, Morgan, but your sneakers really did smell bad. But now they smell nice again, we'd love you to come back home. Maybe I don't want to come back to the teddy house. What? Maybe I'm happy staying with my new best friends, the Bananas. M Morgan? Thanks, Bananas. Do you think we've got a problem, B1? I think we've got a big problem, B2. We have to get Morgan and the teddies back together. Yes, but how? Eggs and spoons! Who wants to be in the egg and spoon race? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's egg and spoon to the rescue time! Excuse us, Rad. Would you like to be in our team? Oh, yes! I love egg and spoon races. And we can race against uh, the teddies. But there are only two of us and there are three of you. Is there anyone here who'd like to join the teddies team? What about you, Morgan? Yes! I mean, um, no thanks. Who needs an egg and spoon race? <laughs> Even if it is my favourite race. Come on, then! Let's get this race started! Come on, Lulu! You can do it! You'll have to go faster than that, Amy. Well done, Bananas! Excellent spoon technique! Hurry, Lulu! Go faster! I'm going as fast as I can! Oh, hopeless teddies! They're gonna get thrashed! OK, Amy, go! Now it's your turn, Rat! Easy, Bananas. Those teddies will never catch me! Go faster, Amy! Look out! Ah! Oh, thanks, Morgan! Can't you go any faster? How can we when it's just two of us against three of them? Unless... Unless what? Unless someone else could join us? Someone who now has nice, clean sneakers? Oh, all right. But we're going to have to really move. Then let's get going. I'm a rat, I'm a rat, I'm an egg and spoon race with a rat. Thanks to my super fast sneakers. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a great sports carnival. And look at all the ribbons we won. Thanks to your help, Morgan. It was fun. Does that mean you'll be moving back, Morgan? Bananas, I have some sad news for you. Oh? I am going back. It's my home. 
It's where I belong. Really? Sorry, bananas. <laughs> it's okay, Morgan. We understand perfectly. Hooray! Phew. Do you smell what I smell, B1? I do, B2. It smells like stinky, stinky sneakers. Oh, I smell it too. But it's not my sneakers. It's Amy and Lulu's. Oh, he's right. Our sneakers smell too. Pwah!